Hey guys, I have an art supply to share with you. Okay, so I have all three sets here of the Black Widow wax-based colored pencils. I know that so many people out there love these colored pencils. So I went to buy a set because I wanted to know, are they really as good as everybody says they are? Okay, so there's three sets. There's one with the Black Widow, we have a Scorpion, and then there's one with a Cobra on the front. And I was trying to figure out which one do I buy. So the only difference I can see here really is the pictures on the front. So I was looking at the color charts online and the color charts really look the same. The only difference is the color names. So I was confused and I thought if I'm confused, I'm sure a lot of you guys are confused. Which one do I buy? So I decided that I need to solve this mystery. I went ahead and bought all three sets. We're gonna go ahead and color swatch them and let's compare, let's find out what's the difference between these sets. Okay, this is gonna be a fun experiment. Let's get started. First of all, we'll start with the Black Widow one. Okay, let's just talk about this packaging for a second. Okay, there's no hinged lid. It comes completely off. I'll be honest with you, this feels, this feels really cheap. So, that being said, here are the colors. Okay, they're not a round barrel. Let me try to pull one out of here. It's not round, it's uh, oh gosh, is that a hexagon shape? Something like that. Okay, it's completely black. This is really weird, it's completely black, so I'm gonna have to look at this, the tip right here to find my color or try to read the color name. So there's no, there's no color on the barrel to me to just see and grab. I have to actually look at this. I don't like that. I'll be honest with you, I don't like that. I don't understand why they would do that other than to save money. That's the only reason I can think of because they all look the same. Okay, let's get started. Let's swatch these colors. So I've made my little um, color chart here. And let me go ahead, you know what I'll do? They have the colors here. Well, oh, they also have the colors on the pencil, so that's good. All right, let's go ahead and get started. The first color is, what is that? Zypher Blue? Okay, it's called Zypher Blue. I'm gonna turn my swatch card this way. Zypher Blue, okay, what does Zypher Blue look like? Well, that's nice, okay. That, that's a nice blue, I like that. They feel good. It feels like a wax pencil. It doesn't feel um, overly waxy, so that's nice. This is called Forget Me Not. It's a, um, it's a hard lead, but it doesn't feel overly hard. It's really easy for the color to for the color to lay down on the paper. That's a nice, um, that's a nice purple. It's called Amethyst. The next color we have is called Starry Night. Okay, so, so far I'm not disappointed. The, um, the color lays down nice, and it does feel like a wax pencil. It's not overly creamy, but I'm not having a problem at all laying the color down. This is called Everglade. I'm happy that it doesn't feel overly waxy either, so that's good. Okay, the next color is called Toxic Green. So they've seems like they've tried to be very creative with their names, their color names, which is fine. Whatever you want to do is fine. Okay, this is called Black Widow. So this must be their, be their black, which is weird that they have it right in the middle of the set. Usually you'll find the black at the end, but they have it right here in the middle. Okay, this is called Tarantula. Which just looks brown. And then we have Foxy Brown. You really do need to make a swatch card and keep it in your tray with you. This is called Spider Web. 
This is like a taupey brown. I don't know what spider web about that, but this one's called Huntsman. This is also a deep brown. This is a lovely shade of brown, though. Okay, this is Stink Bug. All right. And next we have Toadstool. And then we have Pumpkin. Next is called Egg, egg Yolk. Well, okay, that's the color of an egg yolk. Looks like a yellow ochre. Banana. Next, we have lemonade. Casper. So here's their white color. Next is Fang Green. Oh, I like that shade of green. That's a beautiful shade of green. Oh, I just, yeah, that's lovely. Cicada. To me, I would have called that grass green. A bright grass green. Plum Pudding. Ooh, that's like a, that's a magenta. Okay, Ladybug. I'm not having to apply a lot of pressure at all with these, um, with these pencil colors. They, they really are coloring nicely. This is called Watermelon. And the last color we have is, um, Cy oh, cyanide pink? What? Weird. I don't like that name. Okay, so here are the colors for the first set. Let's put this aside and let's swatch the other ones. Okay, the next one we're going to swatch is called, well, it's also Black Widow, but it's the scorpion thing right here. Okay. All right, the first color is called Scorpion. Okay, is that what it's called? No, wait a minute. Oh, that's weird. Okay, so on that set, the color name was here, but on this set, the color name is here. So they've changed the position of the color name. So it's not, it's deep purple. Okay, so there's one, uh, one thing we've noticed different. Oh, okay, I have to say that's a very lovely shade of purple. I like that purple. Now we have pastel purple. The next color is burgundy. Okay, that is a nice burgundy color. Oh, I really like that. Brown Bug. Dark Tan. Charcoal Green. Oh, that's a lovely green. Oh, wow. Okay, that is fabulous. That's a good green. This is called um, Green Grass. Galaxy Blue. Blood Red. Burnt Orange. Next is Honeycomb. That's a nice color. Tanned. Then we have Olive Green. 
nice shade of olive green. I like that. Pig's ear. Then we have lime fruit, which is a very, very bright lime green. Delicious pink. Blue Heaven, Pastel Lemon, okay that's a nice shade of yellow, it's not bad. Club Green, no that's, no Grub, yeah Grub Green. And then Irish Green. Blue Horizon, and then Dark Chocolate, Turquoise, it's a beautiful shade of turquoise, that's lovely. And then the last color in this set, if I can get it out, is called Yellow Sand. It's a, a little bit brighter. It's a, it's a deep, dark yellow, though. Okay, so that is the colors for the Scorpion set. All right, we're going to put this aside, and we have one more set to go. The last set is called, well, this is the, what is that called? A Cobra. Okay. All right. Let's swatch these colors. Okay, so now we're back to having the color name at the end of the pencil right here. So they've switched them again. Alrighty, so this one's called Dim Gray. This is a lovely shade of taupe gray. I love that. Fancy Pink. Mustard. That's a good deep dark yellow, not bright, deep red, uh, Aquarius, oh that's lovely, oh that is a beautiful, beautiful blue. So far I'm not disappointed in the, in the shade of these colors. This is called light yellow, and it is, it's a very light, nice yellow. Flat black. This one is like an ivory, taupey black. I would call that even a dark gray. This is called Cobra. This is like a green, a green gold. And we have Space, a very deep purple that's beautiful. Well, actually, yeah, I was going to say it's a, a bluish purple. It's, it's, yeah, it's, a, it's like a very, very dark blue, but purplish. This is called gold. Purple haze. This is a dark lavender. And then we have venom. I didn't know venom was green. Okay, Tulip, another lilac lavender shade, Charcoal, okay this is a, a another taupey dark gray, Forest, lovely, I love this green, beautiful. Next is Opal Green. Another nice green color. Fire. That's kind of a reddish orange. And we have sunset, an orange color. Next is nougat. Then we have chestnut.
Blood Diamond. Rattlesnake. Bubblegum. And grape. Okay, so those were the colors for the Cobra. Okay, so let me try to, I'm gonna just move these like this so we can look at the, look at them like this and then we'll compare. Okay. All right, let's start with, oh gosh, let's start with this. This is the Scorpion. Is that a Scorpion? No, this is the Black Widow. Okay, so here is the color palette for the Black Widow. It's a complete color palette. You have all the colors that you need, your blues, your greens, your blacks, your browns, yellows and reds. You have everything you need. So th this is a complete palette. Now let's go ahead and look at compared to this Scorpion right here. This is the Scorpion colors. This is also a complete palette. Um, I don't see a lot of difference. I can't tell you, I can't tell you, this is the dark set, this is the light set, these are pastels, these are, these are brights. I, they, it's just, the colors are very slightly, very slightly, let me add, different. It's, um, I cannot think, let me go ahead and share the, this one with you. Okay, so this is the, this is the Cobra and this is the Scorpion. Um, no, this is the Black Widow. Okay, so here are these colors. It's a complete set. Um, the colors, the colors are slightly different, but you do have all the colors you need. Okay, so I'm a little confused by this. Let me, let me see, if, is all this on camera? Let me stand up. Okay. I think these are. Okay, so here is the Scorpion. No, yes, this is the Black Widow and this is the Cobra. They're, each on their own is a complete set. So they all have all the colors you need. The colors are slightly different and the only reason I can think of why they would do that is they want you to buy all three sets so you can get all the colors. But they should have, well, I shouldn't say they should have because they they're, can do whatever they want. It's their company. But <laughs> for us, the consumers, it's confusing because you don't know where to start. Should I get this set? Should I get this set? They're all too similar. They're all too similar. Like I said, they, they, there's no bright set or dark set or pastel set. I don't know what to tell you guys <laughs> other than um, if you want all the colors, you're going to have to get all the sets. So, you know, they all have beautiful colors. I'm not saying they're not beautiful colors. All There's beautiful colors in every single set. The the blues, the the, the greens, the, just the taupes, the red, they're all beautiful. These are all beautiful colors. I am not disappointed at all in the way they colored. They colored really nicely. Um, the colors laid down nice. They did not seem overly waxy. I thought, I thought they were a good colored pencil, especially for the price. They're very affordable. So I can see why everybody likes them. I give them that. I, I really do. I can see why everybody likes them. But I think it's very confusing why they separated this into three separate sets. What was the thinking? I don't, I don't know other than they want you to buy three separate sets. So there it is. The mystery, it's still kind of a mystery. It's still kind of a mystery. What set should you get to start with? I don't know. And I don't know how to recommend that to you other than what colors do you like here they are. <laughs> we did it. We swatched all the colors, so now we know. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this swatch video. I hope you learned something. I think I kind of did. <laughs> all right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.